I've been going through the medicine much more quickly since Shiki returned. I'm beginning to think his poor health can't just be blamed on anemia. In any case, I'll just have to remind him to take it easy. This is my chance to demonstrate my skills as a doctor. Now I just need to draw a bath for Lady Akiha. Check on the gardens. Begin preparing tomorrow's breakfast. Huh? What's going on? What is this strange floating sensation? It almost feels as if I'm in a dream. I don't recall taking any medicine that could produce this kind of side effect. Though, if this really is a dream, I bet I could accomplish even more than I normally could. That said, I'm worried about the town. I can't let anything upset the peace of the Tono family. As a servant of this household, I can show no mercy. It's time to harden my resolve and remove those who would harm that tranquility. Someone who looks like they might be able to assist me. Excuse me, sister. You haven't seen anything suspicious around town, have you? Huh? You come across a scene like this, and that's your first question? Are you making fun of me? Or maybe you're a new dead apostle running low on blood. Dead apostle? Low on blood? Um, I'm not quite sure what you mean. Oh, so you're just not right in the head. Oh, hold on. You're one of the maids at the mansion! This is my lucky day! Fate has decided to serve you to me on a silver platter! You're here alone too, aren't you? I don't sense that family head of yours nearby. I'll be the one asking the questions tonight, little maid. Fair warning, though. My methods aren't exactly pleasant. <laughs> Uh-oh, this is quite the plot twist. It seemed like I've stumbled straight into a monster attack. Time for a speedy withdrawal. My maid senses are telling me this one is all bark and no bite. But even so, a cornered animal can be particularly dangerous. In this situation, a tactical retreat would be more prudent. <laughs> As if I'd let you escape with my silver platter. Looks like I'll have to break a leg or two to keep you from running. <sighs> Has everyone in this town gone crazy? Or is this all one strange dream after all? I would sure explain things like the cemetery in the middle of the station park. Is this snow? It looks like ice. But... It's still fall, I thought. What's this? A visitor? I may not look the part, but I am the lord of this castle. As such, I receive many visitors. You say it's so cold, you are unable to move. I grieve for you, dear woman. I have known more than a few souls just like yours. Like a forgotten ship left to crumble to dust at the edge of the world. Or a broken clock left forgotten on the wall. Our meeting here was not mere chance. This was most likely the work of one of my wives. For her sake, I shall make your death a painless one. What manner of speaking is that? I can't understand a word of it. All I know is that he sounds like a bad guy. For some reason, he also reminds me of Shiki. That being said, it seems you are laboring under a nasty chronic illness. As a doctor, I must do something about this. Prepare yourself, outsider! I will ease your pain with the power of the broom and my medicinal herbs. Those just look like regular garden weeds. Are you sure you know what you're doing? What a wonderful morning! The town looks to be back to normal. And there doesn't seem to be anything wrong with the garden. I'm so glad! Though I'm still not quite sure what that floating sensation or that man in the coat were all about. It 
has me a bit worried. But I suppose not everything in the world can be explained. Even if things seem normal at first glance, society is filled with mysteries and absurdities. If I could think of it that way, my experience last night could be considered akin to a fun little festival. You'd have to be trained me to think everything would make sense as soon as morning came around. Anyway, back to work! All seems in order with the estate, which means all is right with the world. Even so, I must not allow myself to relax. I shall continue to perform my duties with dignity and poise. I am a servant under the employ of the Tono family. I shall serve Lady Akiha to the absolute best of my abilities. <laughs>